Tim Chasen is a Canadian singer-songwriter with his sights set on conquering audiences down under. A talented folk star, Tim's career has seen him team up with some of Australia's biggest names, including Tim Friedman, Shannon Noll and now Diesel. Tim has now joined forces with the Aussie music icon for a national tour. The pair joins us live now to perform a single from their new album. Here they are with Speak Easier. Tim and Diesel's new album, The Last Shower, is out now. You can see the performer dates nationally now. For more info, see The Daily Show info section on our website. Hey, guys. Hi. Welcome How's to the going? show. Welcome oh. back, Diesel. Welcome, Tim. How's Take it us through. Really good. Take us through this collaboration. What brought you two together? Uh, well, we wrote a song on Skype. <laughs> really? <laughs> um, well, yeah, we, we were both in this East Canada Music Awards, yeah. and um, there was a songwriter's breakfast thing where they put songwriters together, kind of like Smashing Atoms. Seeing what happens, <laughs> yeah. the alchemy, and um, we, we figured out that we had to write. If we were going to do the songwriting thing, we had to do it on opposite ends of the globe because I was touring <laughs> WA and he was touring the Eastern Seaboard of America and heading home. And yeah, so we had to write on Skype. So 
Then so, we ended up performing the song, yeah. and um, from then we just thought, yeah, we'll make an EP. A songwriter's breakfast. That's, that's got right. blurred eyes written all over it. <laughs> oh, uh, a little bit, yeah. Now, <laughs> you, you like collaborating with Aussie musicians, right? Oh, is it because yeah. they pay for drinks? So what is it with the Aussie guys? Yeah, they like to drink here. It's great. Uh, like, yeah. Just like Canada, I guess. But, uh, no, it's been uh, it's been awesome. Like, just uh, This is my fifth trip to Australia, and, yeah. and hooking up with Diesel and uh, opening up for him on his tour and uh, playing on this and doing this uh, EP together has been has been pretty amazing, so, yeah. yeah. Hey, would you love a good royal story here? Yeah. Take yeah. us through, you're, you're a musical director with, when the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge came to Canada? Yeah, right? yeah, I, uh, I wow. kind of helped out with all the music that was put together for them uh, for that day whenever they visited. It was uh, in Canada, you know, it was the summertime, but it was still freezing cold. There was rain all over the place and all that kind of thing. But it was, yeah, it worked out great. So music for royalty, what, what do you pick for? Uh, well, some music from back home and some yeah. other, like there's a bunch of other songwriters and, and performers, but uh, like the Celtic music tradition is pretty strong where I'm from, so we did a lot of that, so. Oh, good yeah. stuff. Oh, this is like the closest to royalty we've ever yeah, been. Yeah, I'm going to touch uh, guys, it. <laughs> great, thank you for coming in. That's a sweet sound. That's thank really you. great. And good so. to see uh, Skype, long distance Skyping being put to... Yeah. Yeah. Good use, not That's what, right. not what yeah. you should long distance. Skype we didn't even have visuals. Them. We just, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I just shut it off because it wasn't working properly. So we just, all we needed was audio. <laughs> right audio. Fantastic. Good stuff. Thanks, Love guys. It.